one of the most disturbing superstars around. Hey, Saxton. Yeah? He's coming to get you. Don't, don't say that, Corey. He might hear you. Making his way to the ring from the bottomless pits. Weighing in at 260 pounds, the Boogeyman! Hey, Byron, are those worms coming out of your, your suit pocket? Whoa, wait, no, 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 tell me you're joking, tell me you're joking. <laughs> Cole, why didn't you think of that earlier? He ran away, and now it's time for the Boogeyman! He's coming to get you. There is no telling what terrifying things we might experience here. Boogeyman is more than a few screws loose, Corey. He'll make this match as weird and unsettling as he can. Ray Wyatt has given himself over to the Fiend. One of the most malicious, venomous, bizarre superstars in WWE history. Ask anyone who has had the misfortune of coming into contact with The Fiend. It is an experience that will change your life forever. And certainly not for the better. I know his hands say hurt and heal, but The Fiend seems to focus more on the hurting. Where The Fiend goes, suffering follows. This frightening monster is ready to devour anyone who stands in his way. An eerie supernatural force, and at times seems totally unstoppable. Good luck to his opponent. The Fiend is unlike anyone or anything we've ever seen before. The following contest is a casket match. There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the
No count out of disqualification in this one. The only way to win is to put your opponent in a casket and shut the lid. Pinfalls and submissions mean nothing. Hard for the focus to not be on the casket because this environment is all about embracing chaos and horror. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Damn. Good golly, Miss Molly. Oh, and a double axe handle. Incredible height. Sent flying. Was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Great reversal. If the Fiend was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Power slam. And the Fiend just can't mount any offense. Yeah, the Boogeyman really remaining the aggressor here. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Running STO plants him. Nicely done. The Fiend taking on some damage. Foot to the belly. Oh no, into the casket. Close the lid and it's over. And they got it out of the casket. Thankfully. And this match will head back to the ring. With a clothesline. An impressive chain of moves from Boogeyman. The Fiend is finding no salvation here. And that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Desperate use of the headbutt to get out of trouble. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, right to the throat. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down and oh, oh. stop right to the hand. You can feel the resentment building with each stomp there. There's an air of dark intensity here, Corey. There's a sense of dread. How does that affect the mental aspect of this match? Well, for... They did it! They survived for now! You gotta be breathing a sigh of relief. I don't know what they're looking for here. We've seen the sledgehammer many times before, and it has never been a pretty sight. Oh my gosh! One hand! He's in a little bit of trouble now. The frightening offensive abilities of Boogeyman on full display. A stalemate of counters. What a headbutt. Vicious. Caught that with his face, and now the fiend Bray Wyatt is bleeding. Just scrubbing the face on the canvas. And an elbow drop, too. Delivers the cross body. Getting carried around that spot to be in. Remarkable power being shown here. That move had the amount of force akin to a natural disaster. Worming his way into his opponent's head there. Close call for that superstar. How the hell did they survive? And the feed is clearly looking for a fight here. He steps foot in the ring again. Boogeyman retaliates. Uh oh. Here's the, the boogie slam. Just a sinister amount of power behind that move from the Boogeyman. Boogeyman with his grip cinched in. Boogie bomb! This is the moment. This has to be it. And waiting ringside is a nice cozy casket with his name on it. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Uh-oh, connects the fist to the face. Great counter. He's burying elbows in the midsection.
Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Uh-oh. Reversal, can they go on the attack? Uh-oh. He takes control. Uh-oh. That gets reversed on Boogeyman. Uh-oh. And Boogeyman able to reverse that. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Uh-oh. Oh, oh red right in there. Uh-oh. That gets reversed on Boogeyman. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. Oh, Fiend had it scouted. Elbow puts an end to that. Stiff elbow will break that up. Uh-oh. What a counter. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. Ooh, a heinous rake to the back. Tossing them into the casket. Close the lid, close the... Trying to close the lid, trying. This is going to be tough. It's not over yet. And they're able to fight their way out of the casket. They can't be human. That's ridiculous. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Run! He's got a candle stick. Whoa! Turn that... They are primed for the casket now. But after that move, do you have the energy to get them in? Close line! And some strain getting put on the boogeyman there. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Is it? That may be the final blow that puts him in the casket. No, oh, no, get out of it. Can they close the casket? But the, the opponent. Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently, closing that casket is easier said than done. And he's taking this to the outside now. position to be in right now. Oh, no, 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 no. Power ball across the barricade. Coming back into the ring. Back to the action. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. The Fiend dodges that attack. The 110 Street Slam. Doing whatever it takes. Good night. That's what happens when you let the Fiend in. You seal your own doom. This has clearly become a more grueling fight than anyone could have imagined. It's as if these superstars came out here tonight to prove a point. Oh, he's shoving it down his throat. The claw. This one's over. The vultures are circling now. All he's got to do is get him in the casket and close the lid. Over the top and into the casket. This is over. This is over. Doing their best to try and close the casket. Just delaying the inevitable. And Mercer. 
to believe this one's over. Rest in peace. Here is your winner, The Fiend, Ray Wyatt. The chills begin to calm as the casket match has come to an end. A petrifying final moments to this match. Watching someone struggle for their life. Might as well stay in the casket and take a nap at this point.